Okay, so um, once again, this is my 9,000 mile uh, series of um, updates on the Wolverine X, X4. This is my wet clutch. Um, I checked it at 3,000 miles and uh, 6,000 miles later at 9,000. Figure I should look at it in depth um, and make sure it's still usable. Um, checking my wet clutch shoes, you can see uh, they're in pretty good shape. Still plenty of material. Um, but these uh, these grommets that go inside the shoes, um, mine were elongated. Um, when I first just found out that um, the X2-X4's wet clutch functions like the Terex with these rubber inserts, I was concerned about long-term use where they would break down. Um, well, the good news is they didn't break down, they didn't fall apart because I didn't want rubber getting inside my engine. Um, but like I said, they um, they got like egg shaped. So nobody sells these replacements that I know of. They're made by uh, NOK. Um, so I didn't want to shell out two to three hundred bucks for a new wet clutch because my shoes are still good. So if any of you guys, um, you know, put a lot of mileage eventually, like I do. Um, if you're using synthetic, your uh, clutch shoes will probably last outlast your rubbers here. So what I had to do is I had to um, I had to heat these up and basically re, re um, remold them um, or reform them so they're round. But to show you. I have one shoe removed, spring removed, and um, you know you insert the, uh, the shoe there, and it, without the uh, rubber, it obviously you would have the spring tension against here. Um, I, th I believe what these um, rubbers uh, um, rubbers do is they um, raise the um, <laughs> they raise the uh, the engagement RPMs. Um, so instead of the shoes fighting the um, force of the springs, they're also fighting the force of these rubbers. So. Um, it's an, a nice design because so, so, some others have said it acts as a dampening, so for vibrations, and that could be it as well. But um, I believe it's used to raise the uh, the RPMs at which the shoes engage. Because if this engages at, at too low an RPM, it's going to slip, and that's going to wear out your clutch shoes. By raising the RPMs at that these engage at. It has more bite. So those of you guys who've never don't know how a wet clutch works, you know this is spinning, and then these uh, shoes fly outward and grab the. Uh, you know this is spinning, and then eventually the uh, shoes fly out and it grabs and causes the the drum to spin, which is attached to your sheave. And um, notice how it spins this way, but. The one-way bearing prevents it from going the other direction. Um, so if you're the way the the engine braking works is um, you know if, if you're going slow and this is attached to your drive line. If your drive line's going slower than the engine, the engine's going to hold it back, and that's how your braking your braking works. But um, 
let me install this um this rubber here actually I have to put it in the shoe to get it on there and this one's been oiled they're all they're all oiled somebody else did a um a take on these and they did them dry so it didn't you know they have a lot less friction when um they're oiled okay so somebody had a concern that um these rubbers would prevent the shoe from retracting and as you can see true fully retracts even with those rubbers in place so that's that's not an issue um, so when this flies all the way out let's see what position the uh, rubber's in still uh still fully engaged so these um these rubbers are fully engaged with the, sh the shoe even when it's um, all the way out against the uh, drum and then, um, you know, to retract it. Obviously, you would have the springs pulling out against it. So, it's really not that bad going in and out. So I wish um, if you Yamaha engineers are listening, you could make these rubber inserts available because they're going to outlast the uh, the wet clutch shoes, um, it'd be nice. Um, but I, I have um, a pictorial showing how to recondition these, so they um, they'll grab, they'll, they'll be around again. So that's basically the uh, your wet clutch, how it works. Um, and this is why <laughs> that's my wife, Ellie. Hi. This. this <laughs> this is why the, the, the Yamaha Yamaha uh, belt system works so well um, is due to this wedge clutch. All right, thank you.